Apple recently announced, yet again, that iOS is coming to a car near you. It's called CarPlay, and it'll be available starting later this year. Created quite a buzz, really. But if you don't want to wait and maybe get a new phone and a whole new car just so you can have it, check out how I've created a similar experience starting right now. Hi, John Parson, SoCal Beach Runner here. I want to show you the smartphone integration project. We're going to connect an Apple iPhone to the Mercedes-Benz SLK R171 with Command NTG1 head unit. It's a relatively easy project with a few aftermarket components, and it will give you a car that's going to make even a new Mercedes-Benz owner jealous. Let's get started. Here's our iPhone 4S with 30-pin connector. This also works with an iPhone 5 or newer with lightning adapter. I'll explain later how to get the display out dialog. Now we'll tuck the phone out of sight in the center console where it's not distracting. So this is a stock Command NTG1 head unit. We've got the usual features, audio, satellite, maps. Just want you to see that this is a stock unit. I've installed an aftermarket backup camera video interface. The OEM nav button now doubles as a switch for the iPhone screen. I've adapted an unused center console button that's easy to find and tap eyes free to act as my home button. This is our regular screen. When we put the car in reverse, the backup cam automatically kicks in. Now we'll go back into drive mode. Let's give things a try using this as our home button. Launch Flicktoons. Launch Alarm Clock. Launch Ways. This next part is just using Surrey on an iPhone. You can do this with any iOS device. I'll show you some of my favorite apps that run here in the car. Play playlist on the go. Playlist on the go now playing. Launch Leech Tunes. Launch Alarm Clock Pro. Launch Internet Radio. Launch Google Maps. Launch Flicktoons. Skip this track. I've set up a custom action on my iPhone, so three taps of the home button launches this app. So we're driving hands-free, upgraded navigation. In 500 feet, take a left. At Dawson Place. 
Well, that's my quick overview of the smartphone integration project with the Mercedes-Benz Command head unit. Follow me on Twitter at RealJohnParsons and get all the details in the posts I'm making at slkworld.com. Look for posts by SoCal Beach Runner. Until next time, that's it.